Hey guys, nice to see you again and thank you for watching Cooking with an Italian. Today, you can see it already there, charcuterie. We love charcuterie. This is the best thing I do. Uh, today, we're going to make a roll pancetta. It's something typical Italian and delicious. Easy to do, two recommendations. This is two and a half kilo a piece of, of a belly. I ask my butcher to trim properly. If you find something like that you don't like, you can trim more, but you know, that stuff is done. We need for the first step, just I do this, 40, kilo, uh, 40 grams per kilo of salt, some bay leaves, uh, a teaspoon of uh, nutmeg, and teaspoon, one and a half teaspoon of uh, black pepper. This is the what we need for the, ses, the first step. We mix everything together. The salt I recommend you gonna be sea salt, probably sea salt. It's very important, guys. Okay. When you put this, mix everything. Make sure you gonna have the space in the fridge because it's a big. Uh, Join, you know, you're gonna block the fridge at least per one week. We need the fridge to do the first step. Plus, you need something like this because it's gonna be like that. You know, the blood gonna, the water gonna be under. Okay, I show. We ready to cure. You know, it's without skin. Is that? And we gonna basically we when it's finished, everything gonna be roll like this another thing you have to make sure you're gonna have some skin to put it in okay because this is this pancetta roll is in skin like salami like that stuff like that okay we start we're gonna use all this salt and pepper and we're gonna cure everywhere use everywhere take your time and do everywhere the other side the first step is very easy but this is very important, you cover all the part. Oh, take your time, do this, and when it's uh, nice, I uh, cure all the, the pancetta, I'll show what we're gonna do next step. Basically, we're gonna put it in the fridge, but I'll show you how, okay? See you soon. Okay, guys, the, I'm curing, you see, everywhere, you know, start to move around like this. Now, the next is, we're gonna need this, plus now the bay lid, just like this, because this one, in uh, five to seven, seven days, I think I'm gonna live, but this every day, every day we're gonna turn, okay? Because it's gonna dry from all the side. And now, at the moment, we do just this. Put it like this, okay? This one, basically, Every day from tomorrow, we have to do just this. You know, because it's gonna get dry from here, from here. And in this week, every two days, we're gonna do this. We're gonna move from the other side. That's it. This is the job that we're gonna do the next week. Later, we basically, we're gonna wash it and uh, we're gonna cure again with some uh, more flavor. We're gonna put in the skin and we're gonna leave to have the fermentation and dry. We're gonna be around this pancetta at least, I recommend, three months, even more. But we don't, our challenge is always the fridge. Now, i show you this, the position I do. Later you can find the oil. In my normal fridge, I leave here like this per one week and this i want to show you guys this is my beef salami that's soon gonna be ready okay anyway see you tomorrow maybe i show you the step tomorrow and later uh, we're gonna see you again when it's ready okay but see you tomorrow this is the pancetta after 24 hours you see already how much liquid you see and, and more gonna go just let me now just the thing you have to do was like this just move i'm sorry 
move around like this because we're gonna make sure we're gonna dry for all the side and tomorrow we do the same we do the same stuff plus we gonna move the pancetta like this you see because it's more wet from this side okay we do every two days this the 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 move the other side but we live in the fridge every day we move around week okay see you next week when i'm show you the next step okay make sure you find some uh, skin because this is going in the skin okay see you in one week the the pancetta is being uh, after i left seven days one week always turn from all sides you see it's it's nice and cure now we the the last step is we wanna wash it cure again a little bit and put in skin i find this skin here is uh, like collagen you know i find this it's not easy but i find it first thing in the water warm water i put inside okay this is a big uh, i i gonna need a lot places but we live in the water like this now we're gonna wash it well someone wash it with uh, with uh, water someone wash with wine someone with uh, vinegar i gonna wash it with beer i like it i like that the ingredient we're gonna need to uh, cure again and later put in the skin and uh, leave it to dry i i use because we have a lot different uh, way to do pancetta but this raw pancetta is like my father teach me okay i need two and a half teaspoon of uh, black pepper i i put another two and a half teaspoon of uh, sea salt one and a half garlic ground three four bay leaves this we're gonna just break it like that a three spoon of uh, uh, brown sugar okay now the step is wash it i will make some space just to be always nice and clean now this we can take away out and beer or wine vinegar water what you like i i like this okay ah, a little bit for me okay now guys wash it properly when you wash it very not you do you don't have to be very precise but wash it and dry very well take a glove or some uh, kitchen roll you know and dry it okay when this uh, uh clean and dry i show you the, the the next one okay guys nice nice and dry now always re, uh, you're gonna you're gonna find the space where you're gonna lay in the fridge because this one when we roll it it's gonna be a couple days at room temperature to have the fermentation and later we're gonna in the fridge because our challenge is do the charcuterie in normal fridge uh, but this gonna keep around three for months you know depend how, how do you like but at least couple months gonna be there okay now guys the step is this now we're gonna make sure we're gonna roll it properly you know very nice and square this one i think i'm gonna take we can use for something and this skin here is and now try again yeah i'm gonna be perfect like that okay guys now we do the we mix all together the, our spice, the sugar, this one. This is not uh, obligatory, the bay leaves, but I really love it. Anyway, when you when I eat it, you just take it up away. Okay, mix everything. This is always when you do this stuff, you know, no rush, take your time because it's like hobby. Okay, now we're gonna do again. Wait. Okay? Always guys, if you like this video, share with friends, subscribe on the channel and check out our website, cookingwithanitalian.com Now, we're starting. 
pure again, everywhere, like, like, uh, like we did before. When is everything cure from everywhere? T take your time, all the side, everywhere. I'll show you the next step, okay? The second curing is done. Perfect. Now, is the part, another part very important. We're gonna put it in the skin. Someone, even someone, don't put it in the skin. But I recommend it's much, much better. Okay, now, ah, I forgot to say, in that uh, water with skin, I put inside a couple of teaspoon of uh, vinegar. Okay, now, this is all that. Take your time, okay? I make some space, guys. Always working clean is the best. And now, our pancetta. We roll it very tight. To be honest, someone just mix well, but I, I, I don't want that. I prefer maybe when, when it's ready and when we cut it, we're gonna make square. But now I leave like that. Okay, make, uh, make sure you're gonna have already some uh, string because we're gonna find it very straight, uh, very high. Okay, this, one side like that. Not much, it's okay. I think this, we can cut it. It's gonna stick all together, you know? This is the part very important, guys, okay? Now we do this. Okay, we take our string and we start to do this. Very strong. And we do this again. The same from the other side, but I make a little hole here now. Guys, the, the, this part will be very strong you can. I'll show you this way, but Someone have some, you know, some uh, some web to put inside. But here at all, my really, I don't have much. We do really old fashion, and uh, that's it. Important. We are gonna have the best, the best roll pancetta. I won't show you to do this. You know, guys, you put like this around inside. I do twice inside and take your time lock it here and pull as that and to close it just spin take inside and it's done okay this is what you have to do you know try to do all and i'm gonna show you next okay okay guys the pancetta i did like that well, someone can do bet better, I, I don't know, but now the very important is this. Okay, we cut this, because the pancetta to, to, to be always rolled and together, someone saw it, uh, someone used different uh, uh, web to put inside, to keep together, because this string, they're gonna be loose in the, in the tumble. Anyway, all the uh, inside here, you have to do this, everywhere guys okay this is very important do this everywhere you see take your time here from the bottom and when you we're gonna leave this to 48 24 48 hours in the room temperature why well, they need at least 22 degree you know or put close to the radiator i don't know you you're gonna manage that and later we're gonna put it in the fridge but the solution I give to you and I gonna use as well is this I don't know how do you call this in English but it's you can find everywhere this one I gonna put like that ah this so okay I wanna put maybe I was thinking there was longer uh, and when start B because when you drive the pancetta gonna be literally this one you're gonna string you're gonna keep together but uh, you know i was think gonna work better than this okay okay no this no okay i have to find the longer one but you know i just show you this and uh, try to to find the longer and uh, and use it now this one going i told you room temperature 24-48 hours, put some tray underneath because it's gonna lay 
and see you see you in 24 48 hours on a dry nice okay guys i'm sorry but i find the way to do this and uh, it is exactly like this just double okay you do that you see and this don't too much this all the time this is gonna be loose you're going here and just tidy okay wanna be like that later this we can cut okay like that see you in uh, one two days okay okay guys 48 hours is already dry still a little bit leak look how beautiful it is it's heavy make sure where you're gonna put it in the fridge because this now we're gonna leave in the fridge at least two and a half three months because it's big one i show you my way i do this you know i fix it like that this is some some salami you know i gonna be like this and they're gonna live for two and a half three months this is soon gonna be ready this is beef salami and it's gonna be delicious okay uh, see you in uh, two and a half three months i'm gonna be more precise when it's ready okay ciao guys hungry and 50 days almost five months is gone and the pancetta the roll pancetta is ready i hope i'm so excited now we're going to try it and we're gonna see uh, this is i hope gonna be another masterpiece and we're gonna try it now guys i put all this i don't know in english this just to make easy for someone don't know to tie it you know to link it with the string that is the very very good way to do but the, what we're gonna do we try to to cut it it's not easy to be honest okay i try to cut it this uh i try to cut i'll show you wait okay you put it inside and cut it okay now one more oh the smell is gonna be absolutely super guys the moment wow look at that beautiful wow smell very nice okay i put some skin we take the skin off i'm going to try it the smell is absolutely super we try to cut thin ah look at that. the best way to try it is a little bit of bread but i'm gonna try even without wow guys wow it's another masterpiece well done player. wow i don't believe it's good like that guys absolutely delicious the smell what am i saying guys the pancetta the roll pancetta is this absolutely delicious and if you like figure out and follow us ciao